So I'm back from New Jersey Horror Con 2021, which took place over the weekend of September 3rd through 5th at the Showboat Atlantic City. It was my first convention in a really long time. As a matter of fact, I don't remember what the last convention was that I attended. Horror Hound Indianapolis 2018, I think. Anyway, it was great to be back. I had missed the atmosphere of a convention. I missed the sights. I missed the sounds. Not so much the smells. Although I am happy to report, I observed very little B.O. while at this year's New Jersey Horror Con. So, New Jersey Horror Con attendees? The venue was okay. The showboat is definitely in need of some renovations, let's just say. My hotel room looked, felt, and smelled quite old. It's a pet-friendly hotel, which I actually found to be quite comforting after seeing just how many stains were on the carpet in my room. I assumed at that point that the stains were a product of animal waste and not human waste, or at least I hoped that the stains were from animal waste and not human waste. Still, I refrained from going barefoot in the room as much as possible. Attendance from what I observed seemed kind of scant. On Friday, I was able to slowly peruse the vendor's room and then go and get everything that I wanted signed from celebrities in about an hour and a half. Tops. Saturday was a better day for attendance as per usual when it comes to conventions, but I could still tell that a lot of people were probably hesitant to attend due to the variant. I didn't take in any movie screenings or panel discussions because I had no idea where those things were. The film festival took place on a different floor, and I took a look at the list of panel discussions, and none of them really made me want to seek them out, wherever they were. Stick around to the end of the video to check out the footage that I shot from the event. As for goodies I procured, I only purchased two items from vendors. The first being this leather face, metal cut, um, light fixture thing. I purchased it from Tim at Devil Metal Art. Tim had lots of really cool metal art, but I chose this guy because he'll look good covering the fixture near the Texas Chainsaw Massacre shrine in the man cave. Oh, and it glows in the dark. I also purchased this really cool piece of art from the Art of Barcode and gave it to Eric Freeman because I thought he'd like it. As far as celebs go, I met Jason Lively, Jill Whitlow, and Alan Kaiser from Night of the Creeps and had them sign my Scream Factory Creeps poster. I also got Mr. Kaiser to sign an 8x10 from Mama's Family for my mama, because she loves Mama's Family. I met Bob Elmore, Leatherface from Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2, and had him sign my Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2 mini poster. I met Miko Hughes and had him sign an 8x10 of him holding Church the Cat from Pet Cemetery for Jeremy, because he loves Pet Cemetery, and he loves that evil cat. I met Amelia Kincaid and Hal Havens from Night of the Demons. I had them both sign my Scream Factory lithograph, and Amelia signed my Angela figure. I met Lisa Zane and had her sign an 8x10 of her and Freddy from Freddy's Dead for Jeremy. And I got my Ricky figure signed by the man himself, Eric Freeman. Overall, New Jersey Horror Con was a good time, and it felt really good to be back at a convention after so long. I also had the opportunity to meet several viewers of mine who were also attending the event, which is always a pleasure. If you attended New Jersey Horror Con at the Showboat Atlantic City from September 3rd through 5th, please let me know down in the comments section below. Did you have a good time? Did you have a bad time? Let me know down in the comments section below. If you like this video, please leave it a thumbs up and share it on social media. If you're not following me on social media, those links are in the description. As always, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Take care, and until next time, peace.
Hey, Bubba. Yes. What are you doing? Yes. I brought you back something from New Jersey Horror Con. Ho. Oh. You want to see what it is? Ho. Oh. Check it out. Miko Hughes. It's Miko Hughes and who? Church. From what? Pet Cemetery. What does it say? Jim, now we want to pray with you. Miko Hughes Gage. Gage wants to play with you now, Baba. Yes. And he's going to bring church. Church. Show it to the camera. What do you think? Cool. Think it's cool? Yes. Got you something else. Jimmy, pray forever. Lisa Zane. Lisa Zane from what? Grace Dead, the final nightmare. Show it to the camera. That's Lisa Zane and Freddy. Freddy. Yeah, what do you think, Bubba? Cool. You think they're cool? Yes. All right, cool. Me thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> we'll, 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 get, we'll get frames for them and we'll frame them and put them in. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. We'll frame them and put them up in, uh, in the chair. In the Jeremy Cave. That's right. Yes. Yeah, pretty cool, huh? Yes. All right. A huge shout out to all my patrons and channel members. I appreciate your generosity and support of my channel. Become a patron today and join me for exclusive live streams, get early access to videos, and have a say in what movies I review on my channel. Become a channel member and get access to exclusive badges and emotes to use when I stream. Links are in the description. Say hello to the internet, Jeremy. Hello to the internet.